Asparagus is a wonderful spring-summer veggie that often gets overlooked. Some people think it's too difficult, or maybe they've tasted versions that have turned out less than stellar. I'm going to show you a pretty foolproof way of preparing these little stalks of green goodness that will make them become one of your new favorite go-tos. So grab a cup of hot cocoa. It's time to roast some magic in Mrs. Kringle's kitchen. Preheat your oven to 425 degrees. For this recipe, you'll need one bunch of fresh asparagus, salt, pepper, and one tablespoon of olive oil. The end of the asparagus is very woody and shouldn't be eaten, so you need to cut that off at least two inches from the bottom, but I usually go up three just to make sure. You can see by the bottom, don't nobody want to eat that. Into the trash it goes. Take off the rubber band, give them a wash and pat dry, and lay them onto a cookie sheet. Drizzle one tablespoon of olive oil over them and give them a toss to coat. Spread them out evenly and season with the salt of your choice. I used red Hawaiian salt for ours. Then add some fresh ground black pepper. Put it into the oven for six minutes. Give them a flip with tongs. I like to flip them in the opposite direction so that you're sure that you're getting all of them turned over by seeing which way the direction of the tops are pointing. Spread them out and season more if necessary, and back into the oven for four to seven more minutes depending on the thickness of your asparagus. And then they're ready to serve. Roasted asparagus is a quick, easy recipe that lets you enjoy this veggie at the peak of freshness. It's a heart-healthy veggie that also helps regulate blood sugar and is great for your skin, in case you needed one more reason to get roasting. While it's available year-round, you'll find the best prices February to June. If you like this recipe, give it a thumbs up and share it. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to be notified when new videos go live. If you'd like the full printable recipe, go to my website, mrskringleskitchen.com.